What's up everyone, this is Taco Cakes. I'm back with another Madden 18 video. This is a video on what to do with your extra NFL Combine tokens. Let's go check it out. Uh, there's going to be two ways I'm going to do this video. First off, I'm going to do it from my perspective. I just did the solo portion. I'm not max level. So, um, the max level people get an additional daily Combine token. So, I'm going to do the video from my perspective, which is just did the solos, just did the combine champion post set, and I have a bunch of tokens left. What can I do with them? Then I'm going to look at it from the perspective of somebody that did all the solos, did all the online stuff to get the extra 12 combine badges, and is max level. So let's get to it right now. The ending basically says that all this is the same. So the answer is the same either way you look at it but let's, let's just get right to it and uh, so basically right now there's six days left of this program I am not max level so I get two combine tokens for my daily objectives so that gives me 12 more combine tokens I can get before this promo ends so those 12 tokens can be added to the seven that I currently have to give me 19 tokens so with those 19 tokens, what can I do with that? First off, how many do we need to do a combine champion and an extra one of them? We need two right here. We need four. We need eight from this. We need 22 from this. That adds up to 36 total. So I need 36 and I currently have 19. So I'm going to need 17 more combine badges. So say I just went to the auction house. I'm going to buy these. How much are these going for? How much are the combine badges going for? Well, we have to go to this set basically, because you put the you buy one of these, put the card into the set, and then it gives you one combine token. So one combine token is giving you about fourteen thousand. When I when I did this calculation, it was uh, it was eleven thousand. You can get these for eleven thousand very easily. Uh, if, if people don't know, if you search by name, see how see how expensive this is right now. This is probably a good video for for sniping. I should make separately. But see, these are going for 14000 If I go like this into an individual one of these guys, that Bobby guy right there, watch this. See, 11500 11500 12000 Look at all these way under the 14000 So if you're looking for these, do it by name. You can get these for 11000 So let's just say 11000 is one combine badge. So say I do that. I need 17 more badges to get this set done. So 17 times 11,000, it's going to be about 187,000 coins to get a Combine Champion done. So how much are the Combine Champions going for right now? Ingram, he's going for 205,000. Poe, he's going for 220,000. Garrett, he's going for 200,000. Jones is going for 210,000. Cooks is, I mean, uh, McCaffrey's going for... Uh, 199,000. Cooks is going for 205,000. So basically, when you get this, factor in the like 20,000 tax anyways. You're going to be losing coins, breaking even, somewhere in there. So obviously, uh, taking, the, taking my combine tokens, putting them in the set to get this done is pointless. So what can you do with these combine tokens? Go over here. You have two choices. You can either do this set or this set. So this first set, two combine tokens gives you an 83 to 88 overall player. So those 83 to 88 overall players, we saw they go for around 11,000. You can sometimes sell them for the 14,000 if you want, but let's just stick with 11,000 for this. Because uh, that's my, remember, remember actually that's how much I said like we can buy them for. So let's just keep it 11,000 for this argument. So uh, two times the combine badges. Actually, you know what? Let's, let's put the 14,000. Hold on. Let's just check right here. How much are these going for? So I got to redo my calculations here, of course. But uh, let's see here. So 14,000. So even though you can buy these for 11,000, you can... See, look, someone just bought that for 14,000. You can sell your combine token. You can sell these players for 14,000. So let's go back here. So two combine badges... I have 19 of them, so I can do this set nine times. 
So nine times, and we can sell them for 14,000. That is 126,000. That's what we can do right there. And what can we do right here? We can also take, we get nine of these, right, from doing this, 983 to 88 overall players. We could take six of them, put them in here, and then sell the remaining three 83 to 88 overall players. So what, what does this do? This 89 plus overall player can be at least 75,000. So his value is 75,000, and then we can sell the remaining three at 14,000 a piece. We're looking at, let's see here, three times 14,000 plus these 75,000. So we're looking at 117,000 from doing it this way. So the six combine badges right here, this part was giving me 126,000. This part was giving me 117,000. Okay, so what else can we do if we are max level, we did all the online stuff, then that means we're gonna have uh, 12 more uh, combine tokens for doing it online and six more for being mutt level max which gives you one extra token per day. So that's six more extra tokens for that. So that's 18 more extra tokens added to my 19 is 37 total combine tokens that they're gonna have. So with those 37 total tokens, they can just put that into one of these sets and get a combine player. But that combine player only sells for about 200,000. Or what they can do is they can come in here and they could put those 37 tokens into this set. So they can do this set 18 times at 14,000 per card that you can sell it for. And you're looking at about 252,000, which is very good, coins. And uh, the other option is if they do this 18 times, they could put those uh, cards into here and they can do this set three times out of it because well, they'll have the uh, they'll do this one right here you'll put your 37 tokens in here you can do this set and you'll get 18 83 to 88 overall players then you put those into this and you get three of these uh, the 89 plus overall players that are valued at 75,000 so three times 75,000 is 225,000 so the calculation is the same no matter which way you look at it in that even for me who didn't have max mutt level, I didn't have the uh, online tokens and stuff like that, but still the calculation, no matter which way you did it for, for both of us is taking the combine badges and putting them in this set gives you the most return for your the most coins out of this one. And like I said, remember to put the card up to the value of what this set is. So come into this set right here. This is what the cards were selling for because people don't like to go into individual players' names. They just buy cards based on this. So they'll come in here and go, okay, 14,000, I'm buying this right here. So this is what you sell those cards for. So you sell them for 14,000 per, and that's how you get the most out of your remaining combine tokens if you guys have any questions, put them in the, in, the, in the comments down below. I know this is probably, uh, it was probably, the video didn't make that much sense. But the main thing I want you guys to know is that because so many people open these, open these sets the first few days and stuff, the combine champion prices have tanked so much because there's so many on the market and it's basically made it so that it is not worth it to finish off the set to do another one. If you really want another combine champion, just sell all the combine tokens. Like, take take the combine tokens, put them into the uh, the set right here. Get the 83 to 88 overall players, and then sell those. Get the coins for that. Buy the combine champion you want on the auction house, and then keep the difference. So that is what I recommend doing. Hopefully, you guys are doing this. This is the best way to use your combine badges. Hit the like button if this video helped you guys out. I appreciate every single like. Thank you very much. Hit that sub button if you guys want to know 
when my next video is coming. Hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you guys soon.